Ben, what does it mean when an ex still shows signs of interest but doesn't want a relationship? It's one of these things. She's either trying to get your support, use your support until she finds somebody else, or she still loves you and she's testing you to see if you actually change and you can handle things. Maybe you promise her you've changed or you're going to make changes. She's testing. Either way, what you want to do at this point, you just want to do everything right. What does it mean everything right? It means it's stop showing her emotions. Stop telling her you need the relationship to work. Stop telling her you want her to come back. You want to make your life work. Man, just be cool. All right, things ended. If she doesn't want to be with you, all right, things ended. Now I can be a um, simple, proper friendship. Be around her. When you're around her, she's going to test you. She might even bring up other guys. You cool, you relax, you chill. You set your boundaries. We'll show you in the book and escalate very, very gently. You might hear advice that says, oh yeah, you just tell her I don't want to be your friend and I don't want to be in the friend zone and just don't communicate with her anymore and get away. Friend zone is where it starts. When you meet her, she's going to see that you're actually a different person because she doesn't want to have the same relationship that you guys had. And that's why this friend zone thing temporary is absolutely necessary. Hang in there, hang out, have fun, be cool, pass the test, set the boundaries, very important element. I explain it specifically in the book. Set the boundaries and escalate when the time comes. She doesn't want to be with you. Man, I know she wouldn't be around. I see many, many, many cases like this. And she's done. She's done. Block. Goodbye. See you later. If she said hang out, she wants to be around you. It means she she needs still something from you. Just so do it right from here. And this means you need to understand your emotions. You need to stop making your situation worse. You need to start working on your emotions. You need to emotionally detach from her so you don't need her to make you happy. Then you need to start working on text messages and communication with her. There's a platform for all of this and the link is in the description. Make sure you read my book.